so um, this is going to be a little tutorial to show you how to make um, a, a kind of articulated Minecraft toys that we've been making. We've made Minecraft Dad, this is uh, Duncan, you might recognise him. Oh, and what we're going to do now is we're just going to go make Minecraft Chick. So go to minecraftpaper.com and type in your character, Minecraft character's name, and you'll get that character's texture. And then just print that out. It's as simple as that. So here she is, she's printed out. And I've, uh, I, I've, I'm gonna put her on some card. So I've printed her out um, on, uh, on, on sticky back paper because my card is orange and obviously I can't print her on orange so let's just um, let's just pop her on here Okay, so you can kind of see here, uh, it comes from minecraftpapercraft.com. I'm going to start making a head. So this is how to make it. So I'm using a scalpel. Okay. And you can use a ruler, but because I'm, I've done this quite a few times, I'm going to use Now, if you're going to use a scalpel, uh, one of the things is, you know, to recognise that they're really quite sharp. And uh, if you notice, what I'm doing is my the cutting hand doesn't really move. The thing that I'm cutting moves, so I move that around, uh, and I just cut in the same direction time and time again. And I make sure, really, that I don't put uh, anything in front of the scalpel. Sounds simple enough, uh, like a thumb or a finger and stuff like that. Just uh, I just put the um, the paper at the angle that I need to cut at. So the, the cutting always remains the same angle at the same angle. Uh, and that way, if you do that, you probably won't cut yourself. I say probably. Okay. And so here what I'm doing, once we've cut it all out, we're going to score lightly uh, along the uh, folded edges. Okay. And you can kind of see there's a little bit of a dotted line along there. And we're going to just uh, really just lightly score along there. And, uh, and that'll help, it, help us fold it. So once we've used scored, we can bend our uh, little head into a box shape and make sure we're ready to super glue it together. So I have bent it into a shape and I know exactly where I'm going to start gluing. So I'll just go on this first tab here and we carefully just stick that down. Make sure you don't touch the super glue. Oh, it sounds obvious, but make sure you don't. Uh, if you you can wear gloves, uh, like kind of latex gloves, if you want, and that'll protect your fingers. Because obviously, if you stick your fingers uh, to together, which is more the more dangerous part. If you stick it to paper, it's not so much uh, not so much a problem because you just stick it under the water and the paper will dissolve off. Uh, but it's sticking your fingers together, which is a bit of a problem. And there you have it, there's uh, Minecraft Chick's head complete. Okay, so take your time with these things, don't rush it, and uh, and you can get this thing done quite quickly. Uh, and now what I'm going to do is I'm just going to go through exactly the same procedure for each part of the, of the, the body. So we're going to do the body, and then I do the arms, uh, until we've got all the pieces ready. So, again, cut cut out your, uh, your shape, either use a ruler, or if you feel confident, you can do it like I do, which is just, uh, I'm just doing it by line of sight, really. Uh, I've got a very steady hand. And um, 
and cut the whole thing out. Remember, scalpers are really sharp, and you need to uh, you need to sort of really be careful about using them, okay, and be confident with them as well. You can use scissors. There's nothing nothing preventing you from using scissors. I'm just using this stuff because it's quick. Okay, the next stage is to uh, put all this stuff together. So we've kind of made our little boxes, and I've got some pipe clean here, and um, you can get this kind of uh, you can get this from any kind of craft shop, and um, we we can get it from we get it from uh, the works. Um, you get a whole variety pack of lots of different colours. So when I made Duncan earlier, I used just a white uh, pipe cleaner. So with Minecraft chip, we're using uh, you know the feminine signifier which is pink uh, and uh, I'm just cutting five pieces out and we're just basically going to make uh, a little cut now you can use um, uh, a needle I kind of uh, like a, I, I use a badge needle later on in the video uh, but I'm just just I'm just using my scalpel there and just making a little cross in both the head and the body Okay, so cutting, uh, cutting on nice flat surfaces, you know, reasonably dangerous with a scalpel. Cutting three-dimensional shapes uh, with things, very quite dangerous using a scalpel. So only do it if you're super confident, and if you want to do it, uh, you can use other things to hold the material with. Uh, you might want to use uh, sort of plasticine and things like that. So just be super, super careful um, when when cutting. If you're going to use a scalpel or something like that, or get somebody else to do it, you know, which is, uh, which is another great idea. Uh, so once you've got them together, and you and I've just super glued the uh, part of it to the body, uh, the pipe cleaner to the body, uh, and then but I don't super glue the head on because I want to just be able to have um, some movement in there, and I don't want them to be super glued together and become fixed. And then exactly the same thing, we're going to cut uh, two little holes in the bottom, uh, each one for the legs, and I'm just using it, uh, I'm using, uh, I'm guesstimating where things really are. Okay. So the bottom part was quite hard, and it's because there's multiple folds, so you have to really cut through that card, and I use quite thick card to start off with, so just be really super careful. Um, and then uh, stick your pipe cleaning stuff through, glue it back into the body, so little, da little dabs of super glue uh, into the pipe cleaner. And then you can just shove your legs on and shove your arms on. for watching um, I think it's uh, the rest of it's reasonably self-explanatory so uh, have fun make your own um, do use the website um, do, do have a look at everybody else's kind of creations on the website as well because there's, there's a quite a nice little community of people uh, paper crafters making stuff there which is great uh, and we've really enjoyed it and, uh, and um, enjoy your, your creations and thank you for watching take care now That's it.